Hi, I'm meteorologist Anthony Giannis. I'm in the Verdugo Mountains, and this area burned in 2017 from the Latuna fire. It was the first fire that I could see day and night burning from my house. And a big issue along the West Coast this election is the role of climate change on wildfires. And it isn't as simple as just believing one thing or not believing something. The issue is much more complicated than that. But let's talk about climate change first. First of all, as the climate warms, it dries out the vegetation by evaporation. So here's what happens. You get hotter temperatures. You get more evaporation of all of this brush that you see here. More evaporation leads to drier air. Drier air leads to hotter temperatures. So you see, it's a vicious cycle. In fact, it was so hot in Southern California this summer that the vegetation set a record for how dry it was. So yes, climate change plays a huge role in the rapid spread of wildfires, but it's not the only role. The other issue is forest management. Fire is a natural part of this ecosystem. The Native Americans understood this and they used fire to their benefit. However, the early settlers practiced fire suppression the moment they got here. After all, who wants to see your home go up in smoke? The problem with that is that we've basically gone hundreds of years with the policy of as soon as a fire starts, we put it out. And that has led to overgrowth. That has led to an abundance of fuel that in past years, maybe a hundred years ago, that fuel just wouldn't have been there because mother nature would have taken care of this problem. And we can't ignore the role we play in starting these fires. We now live in the mountains. Power lines run to our homes. In the past, thunderstorms would have started nearly every fire during a time when it's raining. Now we're responsible for starting these fires, or at least most fires. And so when a fire starts, many times it starts in the worst kind of weather, even during Santa Ana winds. That just didn't happen in the past. So a comprehensive policy has to be taken when addressing these Western wildfires. Climate change policy has to be a big part of this, but so does land use. And of course, we can't forget our responsibility. We can't just rely on the government to take care of this problem for us.